As the school bus door opened, the line of kids started to shrink. I heard faint voices of parents saying, have fun, from far away. Some of the voices felt muffled and some were clear as the blue sky. I headed inside the bus, then I chose my seat quietly. I was looking out the window and suddenly the bus started to move. All of the parents started to head home, while others were waving at their kids. Now all of the parents are gone. None of them were seen. The bus was as loud as 383 symbols at once when the school bus door closed. I couldn't stop the noise even thought it was a little bit annoying. After a few minutes of boredom we finally made it to the second stop out of four stops. Approximately six to eight kids headed inside the bus and picked their seats. The bus started to get louder than before, probably hurting some people's ears. I was looking out the window. While the bus was noisy I spotted many trees beginning to have orange leaves and houses along the way since there were a lot of them. One more stop. The bus driver blurted it out. All of the kids who were on that stop went inside the bus and picked their seats. Now the bus was now filled with kids screaming and talking. It was very chaotic. As the bus drove, I saw more houses in different sizes, different colors, along with different types of backyards. I also saw a bunch of trees along the way to the school. Mostly I saw trees with green to orange leaves since it was September at that time. The bus moved slower in the past few minutes. After approximately 15 to 20 minutes, Everything started to halt, slowly. Everybody off the bus, the bus driver said loudly. The bus door opened and there was the school beside me. The school was twice as big as an eight-story floor. I walked into the school, being careful not to trip on something. There were a lot of kids roaming around in the hallways to find their teachers on the first floor, some of them exploring the whole school. Other people were going to the second floor to find their classrooms there. When I found my classroom on the first floor, I peeked into it for the first time in my life. I walked in nervously and unpacked my backpack when suddenly everything was bright as the sun 0.0001 decimeters close to my wide-opened eyes. Then suddenly everything went black. I couldn't see anything, not even the big school. Where am I? I thought to myself. I didn't know what was actually happening for a second but as soon as I said that, I soon woke up in my comfy blue bed. Everything I saw was a dream. Now everything was normal and I was back to my bed again, starting the day all over again.